Hey y'all, I'm Mocha Mazelle and welcome to my channel. I focus on living a location independent lifestyle and providing resources to do so, but today we're gonna take a little bit of a different turn, all right? I'm going to give you six, six, <laughs> very unique and different black um, diaspora or Caribbean and African based brands or businesses to support this holiday season. I also have a little treat I'm gonna put at the end of the video. I think it's cute, I think it's unique, and I think it's different. And it's something mm, I think my Jamaican people in particular will appreciate. All right, so first up, we got Mazizi. All right, Mazizi is a streetwear brand for the African diaspora. Mazizi means roots in Swahili. All right, and it started in 2015. So, I'm gonna give y'all a live uh, runaway show. All right, cause I got me a Mazizi jersey. All right, and I'm gonna let y'all see it. Let's see, let me give y'all, let me see if y'all can see what's going on. Oh, look kind of thing that, look. Y'all see I got Jamaica on it? I got the Jamaican jersey. All right, got the logo here and it got the Africa here. And I even got a customized. Can't show y'all all of that. Look, look. Let me see if I can get it in my chair. Y'all see it? I got Mocha, Mocha 90 on the back. Look at it. Yeah. So yeah, this is a ZZ <laughs> jersey. So I have the link to this um, in my Amazon shop and I'm gonna link it below as well. Sorry for all the noise. Um, but it's on Amazon. If you want to get it customized, you're probably going to have to like actually go to their site and get it customized. It's going to be a bit extra, but I love my Jersey. I can't wear the rocket and they got, um, basically it's the whole diaspora. So they got African, um, jerseys. Uh, let's see what other Caribbean brands they got. I'm gonna let y'all can go. Y'all can go look at all of that, but it's dope and it's different. Senegal, they got the long sleeve ones. They got different styles. Um, they just got straight Africa jerseys, Ghana. Y'all gotta go check them out. I'm really excited. Mazizi um, on Amazon. All right, so next up we have Theophilio. All right, now he is a. Um, designer he's li he lives in new york city but he's from kingston kingston jamaica all right now his stuff is a little bit more on the luxurious side but it's still nice if you can afford it if you can swing it and so he got this uh nice little beach dress of an iron so but <laughs> um it'll be linked below as well and so, yeah, he's been featured um, in Vogue, uh, as in, in Vogue Fashion Fund and named as an emerging American designer. So you can check out his things below. Again, it's a little bit exclusive and expensive, but if you can swing it, go support the, the, the local use. All right. <laughs> all right. So now, Helen from the continent, from Ghana to be exact, all right, we have Studio One. 89 all right they were co-founded it was co-founded by rosario dawson and abrima area hope i'm saying that right <laughs> um based out of ghana based out of africa and they just do a really unique style with the boutique and the clothing so the traditional garments um uh, that we will see they kind of you know put a put a new little flair on it new little spiel new little thing all right, making it modern, bringing it to, you know, well, it's already modern, it's already super fashionable, but you can see they put a whole lot of uh, thought into like the type of people who will be wearing their products. All right, so the next brand that I think you should support this holiday season, all right, is from uh, Vavoon. Vavoon, all right, um, it has Haitian origins from Haiti, all right. Um, they are based in NYC, New York City, but um, it got Haitian Haiti written all over it. So they do a kind of tier of like luxury slash sustainability. Um, so it's kind of 
very much they are intentional with their products and what they are create create and what they create so yeah make sure it's woman owned black woman owned from the caribbean has caribbean roots what else do you need this next brand this next brand when i say i'm getting my summer body back just so i can wear these clothes just so this is next level this is melanin exquisite beach and resort wear when you come out here in a jamaica all right and you want to be the bell of the ball the oh my god who is that i need for y'all y'all gotta go check out this stuff it's like it's it's it, it, it's so it's it's culturally aesthetically uh, everything that a, a a black woman swimwear brand should be. Now, who is this brand? This Ofure. They are based out of Africa. Uh, well, well, it's African um, aesthetic. It has an African um, regal African queen like. Swimwear is very lively, very colorful, and versatile. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you better than I can tell you. I cannot wait to get some of these pieces. Black women, I need for y'all to go. If y'all want to look regal on the beach, you want to be sexy, regal, you just. This is vacation resort wear. This is gonna put you in in the, in the mind of getting getting flued out. Like this is, is it, this is top tier. This is top tier. Y'all gonna see. Y'all, you know what? I'm gonna come back <laughs> and tag this video where y'all see. I'm gonna get in this. Y'all are going to see me in this next summer. Mm-hmm. Now, bringing it back to Jamaica, all right, we have the Yes Rasta hardcover book by Patrick Carew. So it's a black and white uh, portrait and landscape book. Now, I know y'all saying, who want a book for, Car yo, this is, the Jamaican culture was captured so beautifully in this man's photography. All right, like the Rasta lifestyle, the, the jungle dwelling, the living off the land. That Jamaica is what you're gonna see in this book. All right, classic Rasta, um, yeah. And it's like, it's, it's so beautiful, like on a coffee table and a little trinkets. I think it's, it's definitely a collector's item or, you know, some who, somebody who has that old, you know, Jamaican spirit or, or, or wants to reminisce or just think about, like, the nostalgia. I think you should definitely get that for them. It's called a Yes Rasta, and I'm going to post the link below. Don't worry. So, me and my niece was in Fontana the other day, and something caught my eye. And I just had to get it. They got Jamaican Uno cards, y'all. Look. Y'all see it? It got Devin House. Let me see who else they got here. Can y'all see it? Uh-oh. It's blurry. Okay, they got the patties. Y'all see the patties? They got the patties. Let's see what else they got on here. Oh, they got they got the track running. They got the jerk chicken man. They got the river raptor. Let me see if I can take these out. I'm doing an unboxing. This is the first time I took these out. They got Devin House on the front. I'm not using these. These are like a collector's thing. And no, we know Mattel or Uno is not black owned. Black owned, but I think it's still something. It's just something different. Um, different and unique. I don't want to miss all my cards. Hold on, y'all. 
Okay, let's see. Devon House. <gasps> they got the hummingbird. Then they got Dun's, they got Dunn's River Falls. Oh my god! They got the Jamaican bobsled. I don't wanna know who made these. Y'all know who made these. They got the bandana dress. I thought this was Miss Lou. It, that might be her. I don't know if that's her imagery or whatever. Uh, they got the eye key. <laughs> I'm too hyped about these. They got Bamboo Avenue. Oh, look, they got the Rasta Man. Yo, they need to give me an affiliate link or something for these because it's track and field. They got reggae music. They got the rafting. They got Blue Mountain coffee. They got the, the beef patty. Pan chicken man. Y'all see him? That's a drop out. <laughs> Pan chicken man is a drop out. I showed y'all different house for hummingbird. But yeah, and then they just repeat themselves. I wonder if it's a different, I think that's it. Yo, I'm too excited. But, but if you want a local brand to support, um, I saw this game a while ago. It was a bit out of my price range, a bit out of my budget. Um, but I'm gonna show them to y'all anyway. Let me find them. All right, so it is called, guess what? It is a card game. Let's see if I can find some information on it. So these, the Uno cards in this game I'm about to show y'all is only available in Jamaica for my notes. So if you want to get them, I, I honestly, I don't know, maybe you can get somebody to send them over to you or you, or you get them when you come back down. I don't know. Um, but the Guess Why game is supposed to be an interactive word guessing game. And it's built for three or more players. And it's based on the eclectic lifestyle and diverse culture of Jamaica. All right. Um, and yeah, so it has two card decks, clue words that are related to the Jamaican culture. So if y'all want to support them. Guess what? Guess what is a <laughs> y'all want to support them. Uh, yeah, go do it. Guess what card game? And I'm gonna link them to so y'all can support if you want. I don't know if they ship or whatever, but if you're in, in Jamaica, I guess I think they're you know they have local um based places where you can shop and get it. Oh and last but not least, me. <laughs> y'all can go support my shop. All right, shop.mocamazelle.com is live and ready for your support. You can go get your some get you some products that are um, based on me and my appreciation for the Caribbean and some other um, unique things you can get on there. Okay, and I want to thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure you support these brands. Um, they are linked in my Amazon storefront, most of them, or I have a link for you to purchase if you're interested. And I hope y'all enjoy. Make sure you you know. Uh, get them before they sell out because you know this video is just going to get so much traction it's going to go so viral and everybody going to be wanting this stuff so don't wait till the last minute go support these brands these are black um brands and businesses that you can support this holiday season and don't you dare forget to like share and subscribe to my channel all right make sure you share far and wide Make sure you let everybody know about all the unique things they can get to support some black businesses this holiday season. And make sure you turn on that notification bell. All right. So I don't want to see y'all comments about where you been, Mocha. I'm not hear nothing from you. I'm here. <laughs> all right. I'm here. I'm posting. There's not as much, but that's changing. As I told y'all, I'm switching up and I'm revamping some things. But yeah, 2023. 
You're going to be seeing a whole lot more of me. All right. Now, that's it. Love you. Bye.